This is not an actual tutorial, but rather a walkthrough to a problem that I found while playing with HTML and CSS. As you can see here on my website, I have the logo of my company, VoxLab, and this logo is entirely created using only CSS and HTML. In fact, as you can see, I can hold down Control Plus or Command Plus and scale up the page, and you see that the logo doesn't pixelate at all. I've also added uh, other components uh, to the page, like this badge, and the badge pixelates, but the logo doesn't. And the reason why it doesn't is because the entire uh, design is made with HTML and CSS, as you can see from the code. How can you retrieve and actually steal my code? Uh, please go to, go to my website, virgili.com, and in here, type uh, slash sandbox and slash one more time and you will find my index off inside this one you will see voxlab logo.html you can click on it and you are back to the same page now in your uh, browser in this case i'm using google chrome i can go to view and i go to developer and then view source in view source this is all the code that i've used to create my logo as you can see, the HTML is very simple. It just represents a few DIVs, nothing inside those DIVs. You see there is a DIV for uh, bar 1, and another DIV for bar 2, another DIV for bar 3. I'm referring to these 1, 2, and 3 bars on the left. And then it will start with the first leg of the letter V, second leg of the letter V, and then the letter O, first leg of the letter X, second leg of the letter X, and so on. And that's exactly what you see in the code. You see the uh, V leg 1, V leg 2, O, X leg, and so on. So I want to um, test this code in my um, Dreamweaver to understand whether I will have compatibility with other browsers. So I'm going to uh, press Command A or Control A, copy all the code that I have in this uh, page, and then go back to my Dreamweaver CS6. I've already created a new HTML document, and I'm going to paste the code that I've already copied from the web page directly into the code area on the left. Once I do so, I have to refresh with the button on the right in order to see a preview. As you can see, I only can see logo design using the CSS3 by Stefano Virgili. I can see the icon on the top right, but I don't see the VoxLab logo. And why is so? Because now I have to click on the live view in my bar here on top. And there you go. It immediately will display the VoxLab logo. But as you can see, there is something different. The letter O is a square, it's not a round. And I want to explain why so. I want to show that the letter O in CSS is achieved with a DIV called hash O. And inside, it contains one of the rules, which is called border radius 50%. Now, border radius 50% is not digested properly by uh, Dreamweaver CS6. So I have to scroll down, and I will use the same code that I've used for the letter B. As you can see, the letter B is nice and round. This is the letter B. I will just copy the code that you see here and paste it to replace the code of the letter O. So select border radius and paste right here. When I refresh the page now, you see that the letter O become round on the right hand side, but not on the left. And why it's so? Because the letter O now has a different code which is taken from the letter B. In fact, if you take a closer look to the code, it says 0 pixels and 180 pixels for the first two lines, and then 180 and 180 for the next two. Let's see what it's uh, referring to. It's actually, first of all, using a prefix here, which is called WebKit. So it's dash WebKit dash, and then border. This is the same rule that I was using before, but this time I'm specifying that I want to label this rule under the WebKit. Here, it will then define the bottom left radius, as well as the top left, top right, and bottom right. As you can see, the bottom right and top right are making a nice round shape, whereas the top left and bottom left are actually making a uh, right angle. When I change these two values to 180 and 180, and then refresh the page, here we go, I have completed the circle of the letter O.